Airbus. Degree of reliability rests on a highly computerized flight control system, fly-by-wire. The design philosophy that safety is greatly enhanced by automation. If the pilot were to lose control for some reason, the fly-by-wire system would save the airplane. V1, rotate. Captain Martin Alder is a former chairman of the British Airline Pilots Flight Safety Group. Gear up. And a highly experienced Airbus instructor. In the flight simulator, he shows how automation can keep an aircraft under control, even with no help at all from the pilot. In a conventional airplane, instead of this side stick, I'd have quite a big control column here. You need plenty of leverage to apply the mechanical forces you need to move the uh, control surfaces to control the airplane. In a conventional airplane, the pilot pulls mechanical levers to operate a powered hydraulic control system. But with fly-by-wire, the heavyweight gear is replaced by electronics. Now a flight computer carries out the pilot's wishes. The computer keeps the aircraft under precision control during any maneuver, even a simple turn. So if I want to go to the left, stick to the left. Round to the left. The flight computer adjusts the wing and the aircraft rolls to the left. Ordinarily, this would cause the A330 to descend. So the computer compensates by increasing engine thrust and pitching the nose up to maintain a steady altitude. The end result? Totally automatic control. I take my hands off, and there we are. It's flying round. Vertical speed zero, 25 degrees of bank, 240 knots. It's going to fly around at 25 degrees of bank, keep doing this until we get bored. When autopilot is switched on, the plane literally flies itself. 99% of the time when you're sitting as a passenger flying at 35,000 feet, the autopilot is flying the airplane.